mashed potatoes, gravy. I like that you can get anything that you want to get for lunch. My favorite thing about lunch is to eat the pears. I love their pears. In 2016, school lunch looks a lot different than it did 20 years ago. I give my children plenty of choices of fruits and vegetables. Presentation is very important. What's your favorite thing to pick at lunch? Salad. Salad? Yes, sir. Good morning. Over the past decade, new strict federal guidelines have been forcing schools to serve healthier lunches. It sets the stage for what they do in the classroom. So if we feed them nutritious meals, both breakfast, lunch, and in many of our school snacks, then we believe that they will be able to achieve better in the classroom. So here at Lester Elementary School, when students come into the cafeteria and go through the lunch line, they have options. And for some kids, they might choose the less healthy options like potato chips and cookies. But uh, for a lot of the kids here at Lester, they're choosing more healthy options like oranges, apples, and of course, bananas. It keeps our mind going. It keeps it going uh, because fruits and vegetables, they uh, help us get through the day. It offers them an opportunity once again to be exposed to various types of fruits and vegetables that they might not otherwise really want to try or that they may or may not be exposed to once they leave us. Clinton was ground zero when Michelle Obama targeted Mississippi for her Let's Move initiative. You know, I think leadership is key, number one. Uh, we have a governor, we have the state legislature, the state board of ed, schools, principals, all coming together, making the right decisions. In 2013, Mrs. Obama talked one-on-one -on -one with 16 WAPT's Megan West about how to fix the state with the highest child obesity rate. Uh, School-based model changing school lunches and breakfasts have really had an impact because that's where kids are getting so many of their calories. Our students have a salad of the choice every day and it's a different salad of the choice along with what the entree item of the day is. Uh, but you will find that so many of them as, as you've seen today really like salads. But how much does healthy eating cost? 16 WAPT did a little digging. Hello, how you doing? Today, the reimbursement rate for school lunch is $3.16. Eight years ago, before the First Lady's initiative, the cost was $2.47, almost 80 cents cheaper every day for every child. That adds up. $160 more for every student every year. Food costs across this nation has gone up. Even what I spend in my home uh, to eat healthy has gone up. Um, we're dealing with it, but yes, it, it is a little more expensive because of the many choices that we do offer. Some Republican leaders have talked about cutting funding to the National School Lunch Program that has been in place since 1946. We don't plan to do anything any differently. Uh, Congress, though, who, uh, of course, does all of our funding, may say something different. And of course, we would have to make those changes if in fact they did. Millions of dollars in grants go toward the food, staffing, and free lunch for all JPS students. For many of our students, this is the only meal uh, that they get is what we serve them in school. And that's why it's so important for us. In Jackson, Marcus Hunter, 16 WAPT News.